Uh, no different to how we prepare for another test match. We don't look back, we look forward. So we've learned the lessons and um, the trick is to be able to take those lessons and apply them in this test match. Uh, Hakim, you are just back in the team. Uh, do you uh, expect any different thing from you? Uh, I, think any, I think any team that has Shakib in it is very, very fortunate. Um, we welcome him back. It's always great to have him in the change room. His energy is very infectious. He has a lot of experience for the guys to learn from. And whenever Shakib is back, he's, he's a giver. So um, we, we really enjoy having him around the group. Look, I mean, talking to the guys, they, um, they have mentioned talking to the ground staff. You know, he's anticipating a good cricket wicket. Um, so, you know, until both teams bat on it, we won't know what the wicket's like. But at the end of the day, we're not looking at outcomes. We're looking at um, winning small battles along the way um, and just improving on the last game. So whatever the conditions are, the conditions are, we have to adapt and be flexible to them. Yeah, I mean, and, and I think what we, we're missing the point here in that we've got a very young and inexperienced group. Um, you know, the, there was a very elite group before this, um, and now we have to build. So, you know, the, the only thing that we request is that people are patient. These are very, very good young players, but they are young, and they're playing against an experienced team, and it will take time to learn lessons. You know, we wouldn't expect any different from our children when we put them into new environments. We don't expect our kids to suddenly be experts. That's why they go to school. So they're a fantastic group, and let's judge them in two years' time rather than now. I think, you know, from a hunger point of view, you know, they want to do really well in this test. They always really want to do well. They're a fantastic group. They get on very, very well. Um, and you can just see by smiles on their faces. You know, I think the important thing for us as a management group is to manage the mood of the group. And as long as we are level, then we will learn. But we certainly aren't an emotional group and it's not an emotional change room. So, um, yeah, the change room is very, very healthy. How he looks fit uh, rather than in the World Cup? Is he in good shape right now? Yeah, I told him it looks like he's lost weight. So he's been training, he's had a good BPL, he's had a good start to Dhaka Premier League. He's happy, and that's the only place we want Shakib. We want him happy. So he looks great. Uh, do you have any requirement regarding the weekend for the next match? And uh, what do you uh, aim for? What, what do you want for the, from the next match? So from the next match, what we want is to win. I think that's what everyone goes into a game. And from the, from the state of the wicket, you know, we get what we're given. We've got to be able to adapt. Simple. From bowling point of view, there was three quicks in the pivot. How do you see this, this year's bowling lineup? I think we'll make a decision tomorrow morning. Um, you know, these are not, you know, I have the local Chittagong man here, and he tells me the weather's not normally like this. So uh, until we wake up tomorrow morning and see what it's like, we won't make a, a decision on that. Yeah, I mean, we, we've had conversations, and, um, you know, Lytton's in a good space. You know, the, the, the trouble that we generally have is that the pressure on Lytton comes from the outside. You know, I think if we just leave Lytton to be Lytton, I think he'll show you the best of him. Yeah. You know, if we keep jumping on his back in the media and on social media and you keep jumping on his back, we, we forget that just because these guys are very able cricketers and they appear on television, at the root, they're still human beings. So if we treat them like human beings and allow him to do what's, what's best for him, I promise you he'll show you results. Okay. Coach, uh, uh, opening pair of Troy and Jackie, they have been so they haven't had a big partnership yet. yet. Yeah, yet. So maybe they'll surprise you this test match. Right, so on having Sakib, um, Again, we'll, we'll decide that tomorrow morning. 
But as I've said before, having Shakib, when Shakib comes into the group, it creates calmness. You know, it also supp uh, uh, supplies Shanto with uh, an extra person he can get advice from and a very, very experienced person on the field. So it'll, he just brings calm. You know, he's a, he's a world class cricketer. Uh, coach, uh, Shakib, Shakib has told before that he's bowling comes natural to him, but the batting he needs to take it. But he hasn't played a red ball ticket for a long time. So do you think uh, we will get to see the better shutting in this test uh, at his best? You're asking me to go into a crystal ball and tell you what I think is going to happen? What are you expecting from the better shutting? I'll tell you what I expect from him. is He's the professional that he is. He knows what he's done and what he hasn't done. And he'll adapt to the conditions. That's why he's world class. Of course, I mean, Hatu Hatu's here because he's one of the best coaches in the world. But um, what he has done well is that he's set up an environment along with the other support staff where it can just tick over whether we're here. If any of us leave the group, the environment still continues because of the system that Hatu has put in place.